Bounty Hunter. I've heard of you. I'm Fixer 66. I'm with the Operations Branch of Imperial Intelligence. And if you have a moment, I'd like to show you something. You have my attention, Fixer. On the left is an ordinary Republic Kong unit issued to Resistance fighters. You've probably seen hundreds before. This other one is a Republic Kong unit that has undergone some surgery. Please look, don't touch. The second one contains a half kilo of high explosive that detonates when the talk button is pressed. That's intriguing. The plan is to take a few of these sabotaged comm units behind the Resistance's lines and plant them on their dead. The Resistance should soon salvage the comms and take them back to their headquarters. Resulting explosions will cripple and panic them. We'd prefer someone like you to take point. Someone who won't break if captured and who can go without reinforcements. Can you do this? Let's make this happen. Head over to our technical man, a Balmora local we drafted. The men call him Toybox. He'll give you the ordnance and show you how to transport it safely. There's been chatter on the resistance frequencies while you were off planting the ordnance. Resistance grenades have been malfunctioning. Would you know anything about that? It was a strategy to ensure military targets. I will take both the credit and the blame. Civilian casualties are intentional. Both civilian and resistance must fear the bombs. It's how we kill their morale. But besides that point, when you countermand my orders, Imperial troops need to be notified of any change. We now have to throw out every salvaged grenade in the mix because we don't know which ones are rigged to blow. Is this job finished? Be grateful that you are not part of our rank structure. For his part, Toybox will spend a few days in the stockade and receive lashes. You I cannot punish, but I would offer free advice. There are people on this planet who replace everyday items with explosives. Do not push them beyond reason. You're Zalia the Slicer, right? Perel sent me. Yeah. Thank the stars. I don't know how much longer I could have held out. My reconnaissance team was evaluating the factory's computer systems when the droids overpowered us. The droids slaughtered my team. I've been stuck here for days without food, water, or sleep. I know why you're really here, Zelia. You know about my mission? Then you should also know why I can't complete it. I already told Perel. If I put the virus in the computer's control program, it'll trigger alarms. Those droids will swarm us. A few droids aren't gonna hurt me. No offense, but I'm not worried about you. Do I look blaster-proof? We've gotten out of way worse situations. We'll be fine. You're totally set on this, aren't you? Okay. Here goes nothing. I can't believe we're still alive. Don't act so surprised. Oh, my stars. Thank you. You're amazing. I've never seen anything like that. I'm bailing out of here before more droids show up. Running away never felt so good. I wasn't sent here to rescue you, Zalia. Oh. Oh, no. Please don't kill me. I swear I'll go straight. I'll never slice another computer. Just let me go. You have to promise to disappear. Absolutely. I'll change my name. Delete all records of my existence. It'll be like I was never born. I believe her. Besides, Perel's an idiot. He'll never know. I never want to see you again. Got it? You won't. Thank you. Welcome back. I take it everything went well, and the Okara droid factory is running smoothly? And what about Zelia? I trust that slicer won't be a problem. It's like she never even existed. The Admiral will soon see my worth. Master is so wise. Remain silent, my pet. 
or I shall discipline you again. And you don't want that, do you? Here is your payment for taking care of the slicer, my friend. Excellent work. Your next assignment concerns the local fauna. Colonel Sartius is responsible for keeping our citizenry safe from the deadly colicoids infesting this planet. Dangerous jobs are my specialty. I'm in. Colicoids are vicious, giant, insect-like creatures that devour anything in their path. Their exact origin on Balmora is unclear. After the Empire's invasion, the Balmorans released mutated colicoids into the wilderness. The creatures successfully bred and have become a plague on the population. The colicoids have become almost docile in recent months. Attacks are down all across the planet. That makes Colonel Sarsius look like he's got this plague under control. But we know better, don't we? I'm not interested in guessing games, Perel. What's your plan? Simple. If docile colicoids are the problem, then we must strive to make them hostile again. The last time they attacked in force was when a survey team accidentally encountered a colicoid queen. It took five squads to kill her. Zupuda nupajunki, vaguta ji uta vukise. Guptola, dupatwana duana wanki, slimo pod yukata janga. I need to know what tools to take for the job. Kiko ubakili, wata bunga dunko, putoga wata. Place this sonic device near the nest entrance. It will confuse and anger the colicoids. Kill any drones and warriors you see. Eventually, the queen will reveal herself. The sonic device will disorient her, leveling the playing field so you get a fair shot. Be fast and careful. <laughs> 